All right, so now let's look at a hammer lock from crossbody ride. We started off with attacking your partner's legs, now we're gonna go to the arms, then to the neck, and then eventually go into a back take on our partner, okay? So we start off initially with the crossbody ride. Our partner lays down, and we enter into an initial crossbody. Now this time, we go to attack initially our partner's legs. She defends by extending, and we move out to our partner's wrist and arm like so. We're gonna glue our partner's hand to our chest. Once we glue our partner's hand to our chest, our goal from here is to put our partner's hand down to the ground. If I can put my partner's hand down to the ground, we're gonna be in good position to go into all of our attacks. Once I plant my partner's hand in the ground, the closer I can initially get my partner's hand to her armpit, the tighter everything's gonna be. So I push my partner's hand down towards the floor and I bring the hand in by the armpit. When she goes to extend the hand, it's not an easy thing. She has to move her head away from me in order to do that, and it's difficult because of my hand positioning. We're gonna take our left hand in this case out, and we're gonna plant our wrist and forearm over our partner's wrist, like so. Now we're gonna take our hand through, and we're gonna catch a grip on our partner's shoulder. Because your forearm now and your uh, forearm and your elbow are wedged on top of your partner's wrist, when she goes to extend and straighten her arm, it's difficult. And now we come in and we lock hand over hand. We pull our partner towards us. Now the finish is a pulling of the shoulder towards me as I take uh, my partner's hand up to the armpit with my left elbow and we get incredibly strong hammerlock finishes by pulling the elbow, similar to with Kimura's how we pulled the elbow up. We're, we're wedging the hand in place with the left elbow so that I can take her, uh, I can keep her hand up by the armpit. Now the finish is a pull of the shoulder towards me and we get incredibly strong hammerlock finishes for the win. So we enter into a cross body ride. We initially go into attack our partner's legs. We grab our partner's wrist and we glue the hand to our chest. Now, if we can get the hand to the floor, we're gonna push the hand in. We put a, we put a bend in our partner's arm by chopping the hand down like so. So we put a bend at the, uh, at the elbow. We push our partner's hand down to the ground. Now we take our hand out. We cover our partner's wrist. When our partner goes to extend the arm, my right hand initially keeps it in place. And then once I reach through and grab my partner's shoulder, my left hand keeps it in place. Now we come in and we take two hands and we lock over our partner's shoulder. Our head comes in close initially. Now, as we go to finish, we pull our partner's shoulder towards us. And that gives us strong finishes for a hammer lock. And then we can go into attacking our partner's back off of that. So our partner defends the hammer lock and we go in, we attack our partner's back and we get to the upper body and go in for the win.